Hi, this is Michael Barnard at the 2012 NAB show here in Las Vegas. It's part of the National Association of Broadcasters convention that happens here. It fills the entire Las Vegas Convention Center. There will be about 100,000 people coming here to look at about 2,000 vendors of this entire group. About 10,000 consider themselves to be filmmakers. So we're going to take a look at a few of the items that might be of interest to filmmakers. Hi, I'm with Dan at Black Magic Design and they've got a really kick-ass camera for filmmakers. Hey, so look, the idea behind this is we wanted to create a camera that kind of fits somewhere between a DSLR and a, and a real cinema camera. We wanted to have a real 2.5K uh, image sensor on there, so it's got bigger than the HD video resolution. It's got a high dynamic range, 13 stops, records to an SSD, has its Thunderbolt out. We include a full copy of Resolve with it. Because when it's Cinema DNG RAW, right, you can white balance it, but why? It's it's got all that information. You're gonna wanna bring in that raw information and color grade it. That's the big benefit of being able to do raw. The idea being that you know you've got really super high quality openness to the camera, so you have choices of what you're recording, the cinema DNG, RAW, uh, ProRes or DNX HD, but it has that cinema feel to the camera that you're not gonna get off of other video cameras. Um, bit. But it's 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 not like Black Magic RAW where we tweak it or anything. Cinema DNG RAW 12 bit is everything. It's all the data, all the lines, all the color. It's no sampling. It's everything. So that's a that's a that's a thing that's not really available at a price point lower than thirty grand. The Black Magic Cinema Camera. We're looking at shipping this thing in July. Our retail price is two thousand nine hundred ninety-five dollars. I'm with Alan from PS Technic with a uh, another high-speed camera. <laughs> Indeed, another high-speed camera. This is uh, the PS Technic X35. It's the PS Cam X35. We call it a motion effects camera. The camera basically does anywhere from one frame a second to 450 frames a second. Or if you look at it in terms of time lapse, it does one frame a day to 450 frames a second. So it's a really easy to use high-speed camera. We've kind of got it in what we call Dr. Seuss mode. We're having a uh, contest to see how many things we can pimp it out with. And so we've got the OB-1 S2 recorder. We've got the Blackmagic Design Hyper Shuttle. We've got the Gemini. Um, Convergent Design Gemini here. Um, we were going to try to get another recorder stuck on there. Uh, we've got a trans video monitor. We've got another monitor on here. So we're kind of pimping it out just to be silly, really. Most of the time we wouldn't have much of that on here, but since it's at the show, we decided to do that. But very easy to use, very quick um, to set camera that you can shoot all of your regular six sound material with, and then without having to switch uh, into a, a high-speed camera, in other words, without having to switch the body, you just basically switch into high-speed mode and shoot with this camera. So it's very easy to use, very quick, and uh, people seem to like it. We've been shooting a lot with it, a lot of commercials, a lot of rock videos, a lot of fighting. A lot of boxing, a lot of ultimate fighting. There doesn't seem to be anything new in 3D rigs. They're still big and complicated and weird. But when it comes to broadcasting, 3D is coming on strong for broadcasting.